Hello and welcome to this new video. It is a part of a list, so if you are new, please take a look to the previous videos because they are all connected. You will find the link on the description below. In our last video, we saw basic operation using the MQTT protocol. In this video, we will make a project where we will control an LED with a push button remotely over MQTT. Before we start, I advise you to test your push button and the LED. I made already a video about these two components. This is uh, my program that controls an LED with a, a push button locally. We should have uh, the same result using uh, what we learned with MQTT. The first program will be for uh, the publisher. Basically, I need to, to publish the value of the button every time uh, its value changes. First, I will make the MQTT connection part. Here I will create two variables, one containing the old status of the button and another one for the new status. I will publish a message only when these values are different. There is no need to send every small lapse of time a message. If I keep this version of the program, I will have an error when it's interrupted. So I added the try block to leave properly. My first program now is ready. I will try to test it.
so I'm expected to have a new value published every time the button is pressed or released. Here I'm checking on the Windows client and it's working. Every time I press or release the button, I have a new published value. Now let's move to the second program of the second device. Here we have an LED. The program will subscribe to the topic test. If the received message is zero, I will turn on the LED. Otherwise, I will turn it off. Unfortunately, I don't have two boards, so I will put the program in the same board, but for sure it will work. The error here came because I did not change the address of the broker, so beware about this.
I, I'm running here both programs, the publisher and the subscriber, and uh, it's working. Now, this is uh, the video uh, I made uh, of my project. In the end, I hope that you liked the video and see you soon. Bye.